not between you and You see this? This is what you do not get. What's going on guys ah. so guys today i'm coming to you all with a new video so you know valentine's day is approaching and i want to share some do's and some don'ts with you so before we get into that guys make sure that you are gonna hit that like button Definitely make sure that you share this video along with any of my other videos, guys. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please make sure that you hit that subscribe button. And for those of you who have subscribed to my channel, make sure that you turn on that notification bell so that you are notified when my videos drop. And yeah, so that's that. Okay, guys. So today... I decided to do a little vlog um, sharing with you all some do's and some don'ts, uh, what to do and what not to do on Valentine's Day for your partner, your wife, whomever, whatever you want to call your significant other. Um, so just kind of doing this over and over again, you kind of get a better understanding of what that person may like and may not like or just... You know how it's it's so commercial. It's on TV. It's like, oh, get this to get this. So one thing I am going to say, like, I mean, for me, and I, I don't know any of you all, but like that, but like for me, like getting like the huge balloon that says, oh, you know, like a big Valentine's Day balloon that says, I love you on it or getting this huge Valentine's bear, you know, like those aren't things that. I know my wife does not want, and I just know other people may not want. It just don't. I feel like when you get those things, you're just getting something to get it. So, the key is is to listen. Always listen to what your partner says, even if it's not. I mean, like it could be any time. It could be any time throughout. Like you guys can watch on TV. They can bring something up. Oh, you know, I love that swimsuit. This is really what I want, or like. Oh, you know, this new watch or just whatever it is. Just you just have to listen because sometimes you're gonna be able to act on those things like Valentine's Day, birthdays, whatever it is, and get them that because you know that's gonna save for you and it's gonna get you some points because you was listening. You put your listening ear on it, you heard what they had to say. So that's what I've learned to do over time, is just listen. Really listen, you know what I mean? And then another thing is, too, you want to get something that is meaningful. You don't want to get something that that person can hold and have, like, a bear for, like, what, a couple days and maybe sits in their bed. But, you know, it's, it's, it's I don't know. I just think that's kind of whack. But, I mean, if that's, if that's, you know, your age group or whatever it is and that's what you guys are all doing, then do that. But, like, definitely... It's definitely it comes down to like the your listening skills, you know, and like just knowing your partner, knowing your wife, you know. So what I'm going to share with you all today is what I have gotten for Kim for Valentine's Day. So Would you be my Valentine? <laughs> How to say that? Um, so yeah, guys. So you know, like, like I definitely listen to my wife over time. You know, I, I listen to everything that she says that she wants. So I went out and I got her a couple things. And I'm gonna show you guys. So first things first. A hey, a. Hey, um, oh, I'm sorry about that. So I'm gonna get that right there. I got her this really cute bag where all the, her gifts are going to go into. It's just, it's a little heart bag. And they had some on there that said, you know, which my Valentine and love and all that. But the thing is, guys, I love Kim every day. Every single day I love her. So 
I don't want her to, I don't want it to, I don't want to make it seem like I love you because it's Valentine's Day and I'm just getting you this and all this and that because this is the things that I do daily for her. And my, me personally, I like love like holidays and stuff like that, like anything that's like where you can do something. That's just me. I love it. So she's not that kind of a gal, but that's me. You know what I mean? Like, that's just what I like to do. So I got her a heart bag. The heart says a lot. And she knows if she looks at this bag, even if it was somewhere, she knew that I would be the one and I'd get her something like that. So I got her this bag. And what I'm going to do while I do that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to, um, let me move this here. I'm going to go and I'm going to start getting stuff into the bag there. Um, so I got some paper. I didn't get this paper for the bags today. I got it for her birthday, but I'm going to try to match it with, um, okay. And one of her favorite colors is orange. And the thing is, there is some orange in the bag. So I'm gonna use that for this. Here is the cute little paper that we're gonna do. So first things first. Let's do this. Uh, let's see what we're gonna do for the thumbnail and that bag. All right, guys. So I got a bag of goodies here. So again, like I said, I listen to Kim, and I like, and I've known her for many, many of years. So I kind of know what she likes and what she doesn't like, you know. And then you know, people like to get candies and candies, but this is the thing: she loves certain candies, and she's not really doing any candy right now. So, but I did went and get her some gourmet truffles. Cause she loves truffles. So these are the truffles I got her. They're like. Um, there's six different kinds. We got a milk chocolate, a hazelnut, extra dark chocolate truffle, a dark chocolate truffle, white chocolate truffle, and a vanilla truffle. So I'm gonna put that in here. I'm trying to think if I wanna put that on the bottom, bottom of the bag. I think I'm gonna put it on the bottom, bottom of the bag. So like I would, what I like to do is just put the stuff in here and then kinda um, put the bag on top of it over there. And so, Kim, I just, okay, so let's do these one first. She loves hoop. She's definitely a hoop girl. So I was at, no, I was at Target. I got her some, and these are gold ones. She has a lot of silver ones. So these are some uh, gold hoops that she really likes. And she really is looking for some huge, huge, like thin, really thin ones. So I got her these, and they are kind of, they're not like a perfect circle. They kind of have some kind of whatever in it, but. I don't know. I think she'll like these a lot. So I'm gonna put these in here and I'm actually just gonna lay them. I wanna wrap them. Hmm. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll wrap them in this paper here. But you know they say you just shouldn't put like jewelry down in, in the bag. Because it can get like dented or whatever. I, know, whatever. I was gonna wrap it at the store, so I might as well wrap it. Hey. Yes, guys, so um, what are your plans for Valentine's Day? Are you guys gonna do something? Uh, Kim and I were planning on just like going to happy hour, get some happy hour food, and you know, because we didn't make a reservation. I told her I could have made a reservation, but she's like, no, let's just go to do a happy hour and you know, sit at the bar and have a couple drinks, and you know, so we're gonna try bonefish. Bonefish has really good food, and you sit at the bar, you can have off on it, and it's really good food. So, all right, so I got it. Those two things, all right, and so we both have like, you know, Apple Watches, not the fours or threes. So I got her this um, really cute um, band. It's like a, I think it's like a pinkish. And I know she's like really into like, like pink and stuff. So I got her that right there. She's gonna love that. She really didn't want me to get her anything, but you guys, I just do things like this because I like doing it, you know what I mean? Like, it makes me happy to give gifts, you know? Like, I don't necessarily, I'm not gonna necessarily say I don't like getting anything in return, but I don't ask for anything in return. So if, you know, like just us going to dinner and doing something like that, that's like enough gift for me. You know what I mean? It's, it's just, in relationships, it's just kind of like, you know, you have to, I feel like for me, I like to give more. Than receiving. So that's gifts or just things. 
All right, and then I got her just these two shirts, and they're like t-shirts, and she's just like, she's really into this mustard color look, like in anything, mostly shoes, and then she really loves like, I don't know, she's like into army now, like the army colors, so I got her this, just some t-shirts, and I got her those because Kim doesn't really like do t-shirts, but you know, she's, you know, mixing up her look a little bit, so I thought I'd contribute to that by getting her these. On top of all of this, guys, you always want to remember to get gift receipts in. Gift receipts is what I have. I definitely have gift receipts because I, if I know Kim, if something doesn't work out, she's definitely going to return it. And you can't feel bad about it if someone returns it because you kind of have to expect them to re return something because that's just how it is. Um, and then I got her this really, really cute card, guys. Um, I'll read it for you guys. It's really cute. Uh, so it's right here. And then it kind of goes like this. <laughs> I think it's really cute. So the card it says, my wife, my Valentine, your kindness. It says, your kindness always warms my heart. You're thoughtful, selfless, fun, and smart. That was the fun. Now we go to this one. Your sense of humor makes me smile. You got a lot of class and style. You're quite attractive, by the way. The total package, some might say. <laughs> And you, and then there's like a little graft. Um, it's really here. It's a little graft. You, there's no one who I'd rep, who I rate above you. I see that. It's her. She's at the top dot there. And then it says, I'd be a dumbass not to love you. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. So look at that. Isn't that just so freaking cute? I love it. I love, love, love it. So I'm going to fill that out. So I'm not going to put that in there yet because I want to wait to fill that card out. So that card I got her and that will be going in the bag. And so that's it, guys. You know, I got a, a couple things like that, like the candy, the two shirts, your earrings, and um, the watch band. And then just is like, for, I, I, like, we haven't been doing candy a lot, but I'm going to put, like, some of these candies in the bag. And I'm going to share this with her mom and, like... Richard and those guys and make them a little candy bag today because we're going to be going over there for dinner. So these are right here. They're conversation hearts, which everybody knows these from back in the day, but they kind of mix them up. Now this kind is the sweet and sour. And I just got these because I'm going to eat the hell out of them. They are the Tootsie Roll only cherry, guys. This is a bag of cherry ones that they had there. So we got that. And then I'm going to hook it up with some Rice Krispie Treats and I'm going to make them into little hearts, guys. Um, so yeah, that's it. So that is what I got for my wife for Valentine's Day. Um, and like I said, you know, if you're going to get your partner something, if you do, make sure it's from the heart. Make sure it's thoughtful. Don't go out there and do it just because it's Valentine's Day and you feel like you need to get something. Remember, you got to always listen, 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 listen. And get, do it with some meaning and some thought behind it. Like, think about it. Because that right there, I'm telling you, women, I'm sure men, love it. They do. And I love my wife. And thank you guys. Thank you for watching this video. Um, again, if you like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you go ahead and share it. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button, guys. We're almost at 100 subscribers. <sighs> almost, not there yet. Um, and also, if you have subscribed, make sure that you turn on that notification bell so that you're notified when my videos drop. And I'm out.